morning guys i like talking faces to a new day and a new vlog and you'll never guess what but it's the weekend 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 and you know what that means you get a weekend vlog Woo! but what day is that nope not the funeral care We've got Rice Krispies! So if you don't know, as you can tell, I absolutely love Rice Krispies as a cereal. It's probably my favourite. So I'm quite glad that Pumpkin has pulled that out of a bag this morning and got me Rice Krispies. So thanks again, Pumpkin. But first, we've got tea, we've got toast, and we've got editing in the vlog, and the Rice Krispies as well. But they all be like a morning snack at 10 o'clock. So I usually get hungry about 10 o'clock. So... It's all fun and games here today. I don't know what we're doing this evening, but I'll bring you on the journey. So before I do any of that, I forgot to mention that uh, whilst taking Pumpkin to work, we nearly had a bit of an accident on the road. Oh, hello, Jesse. And basically, behind where we live, there's a road that runs like round the full like estate. And then there's like a farmer's field with a couple of like hedges and trees and stuff in front. So... As driving along and it's dark at quarter past seven, the, we catch it last minute and break and there's a massive tree like branch thing, load of branches and stuff that had fallen into the road, so fallen into the road and it's very difficult to see in the dark. I know anything's difficult to see in the dark but I mean because of the way, how frail like the branches are and skinny they are, there's loads of them but it just mingles in because of the background. So you can't really see it until you get like close to it. So I accidentally like, drove into it slightly by the start, but then braked and moved out of the way. So luckily we're okay, but it could be dangerous. Um, however, I was going to report it to the council, but I've seen on Facebook that somebody's going to come and, I think it's the farmer, obviously, is going to come and clear it later. So if that gets cleared later, good, perfect. If not, if it's not done by lunchtime, I'll probably report it to the council and then get that removed. Because otherwise, it, somebody's going to have an accident. Right, it's that time in the vlog where I tell you I'm in the office and it's uh, time to crack on with work, get the tasks done, get the trello board ticked off, and then finish the day. But first, I thought I'd give you an update about the tree behind us. Um, I will insert an image of what it was like here. And yeah, it was pretty bad, but... I've just gone to look at uh, out the back bedroom and well the back window and it's been cleared so the guy on Facebook definitely has come along and cleared it which is good which means I don't have to report to the council and we don't have to wait 24 hours over it is for the council to turn up and remove it so thanks to whoever the guy was on Facebook that removed it the farmer whoever it is thanks now what have any accidents but yeah as I said in the office cracking on with work one more working day and then it's the weekend so I'm excited about that. So I'll see you when work is done. Weekend, 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 weekend. So it's now the weekend, work is done. Tasks are done, newsletters are done. Everything's good. But yeah, so it's been a quite productive today actually. Like I normally message Pumpkin while she's on a break and it's usually straight away, like when she messages, I'll see it, you know, message. However, I was about 10 minutes late, and that's because I've been so productive today that I just haven't had time to look at anything else. Which is pretty good, to be fair. So, um, I'm quite happy with that. And because I've been so productive, I think, before I go pick the pumpkin dater up, I think it's time for a bit of a drink. So, yeah. In the form of a cup of tea. Had your full day, you thought you could have like a beer or a, or a rum or whatever. No. Or something alcoholic, no. It's a cup of tea. I'd rather have a cup of tea than something alcoholic in a minute. But yeah, cup of tea. Because one, I'm driving, and two, just fancy a cup of tea. So ha, how do you fall? And with that funny little clip out of the way, which to fairy, I thought was going to be funnier than it was. Like, in my head, it was funny. Maybe, like, maybe I just need to get out of the house. Like, maybe I get inside my head too much. Maybe I think I'm too funny myself. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh no, but yeah, with that out of the way now, it's time to play some GTA before I pick Pumpkin up. Because I've got about an hour now, and during work today I've watched too much stuff on YouTube and whatnot, so 
I'm uh, gonna crack on, crack on. I'm gonna play some GTA and do something different. We're back, we made it. And Pumpkin is in the house, been picked up. Here she is, she's gonna say hello. Hi. What's the tea? What's the tea? What's the tea? I know we had burgers yesterday, tonight? but we've got chicken steak sandwiches. Mmm. Exactly. Oops, I recovered my phone, it just flew out of my hand. What I was trying to do was this. Mmm, not a wee! And flew out of my hands, you know. But yeah, chicken steaks sound good. Pumpkin's in pain because the phone landed on her foot, and I'm very sorry about that. But it just flew out of my hand, he went wee! And it's as easy as pie. Straight in the air fryer, chicken steaks, onion rings, done. 20 minutes ish, just check them every so often, done. Easy as pie, don't have to leave it on. Don't use much less electricity. There we go, English. So yeah, I am happy with that air fryer. Happy that I'm, to fair, I'm happy when on the package it says you can air fry it. I'm like, yeah, so much easier, so much quicker and healthier to a degree. So we've got about 15 minutes left on the air fryer, which is good. But <laughs> has anybody else got that TikTok song stuck in their head? There's a burger at my nan's door. And it's getting effing cold. He does swear, but yeah. There's a burger at my nan's door. It's stuck in me, like whenever there's a silent moment, or oh, I'm just doing some on my own. I'll, I'll just be making a drink. Over here, making a drink going, there's a burger at my nan's door. Or oh, there's a burger on the dance floor even. It's even better, you know. It's stuck in my head, and I wish it wasn't. I have just realized that I forgot to show you the, uh, the burgers of the chicken steaks. Like a fool. Because I was so hungry and I ate them. And that's the truth. That's the honest truth. I forgot to show you the burgers because I forgot to vlog. I'm clearly in the process of getting changed and there's a reason for that. So it's Pumpkin's sister's birthday and we've just been asked if we want to go to the pub to celebrate your birthday. So we're getting changed, we're dashing out of the house and we're getting there in time to meet her at the pub. So that'll be fun and first time I've gone to the pub in a while, you know, for a proper like drink. You know, for no food, or whatever you just drink. It's been a while, so it's gonna be good. Yeah, I'm not wearing this, I have got my shirt. I've got my shirt there, my green uh, mix match one, which I do love. And we're watching Tom's vlog as well. Whilst I get changed, Tom, we're watching you whilst I get changed. Sounds really creepy, but it's not creepy. I'm just getting changed whilst that's on, because otherwise I won't be able to watch it today. But I will be later, but I wanna see what happens. So I'm really hoping this all goes to plan. So I'm intrigued as to what's happening. And I thought, what's I going to change? Somewhere to point in the background. So, to the pub we go! Night, night. <laughs> right. Party, party, disco, oh, you can see me now. Oh, hey, there we go. So, one drink down. How many more to go? 21. Oh, 21. 21 to go. No chance. Not 21. <laughs> but we are going now. And we'll show... We'll... <laughs> and we will see you in the pub. Wow, it's red. So... <laughs> We've got to the pub, right? And you're wondering why is the pub in a shed? Hi! Um, so why is the pub in a shed? It's not in a shed, it's not a pub shed, it's not a shed pub. Um, so where the pub is, just around the corner from us, they have like these outdoor sheds where you can sit in, you get like the lighting, you know, the lighting, the heater, which brings me. out lighting. <laughs> We've got Frankie. Happy birthday, Frankie. Evening. Evening. <laughs> We've got Pumpkin Easy Scene, and I am currently drinking the cores because, you know, it's, it's an easy one. So. That's that. Good morning guys, I like talking faces to a new day and the same vlog as it's the weekend vlog as you know and this morning I've got my tea my toast that should help me because I feel a bit icky from last night didn't drink that much, only like two or three but because I don't drink that much it hit me a lot harder or easy, I don't know which way you say it but yeah um, uh, but I'm a little disappointed because I bought these three um, lots of lemonade um, expecting us to drink a bit more, you know, before we went out. And when I got back, oh yeah, we're going out in a minute. Great, okay, so um, that was a bit of a wasted trip then. But it's fine, it is what it is. But it was a good night, because we got to spend, uh, spend it with Pumpkin's sister for her birthday, um, which was good and fun. So today, what's happening today? Today, as I said, I've got my team, my toes. Gonna watch a bit of YouTube. Uh, and then, not really too sure, I think today I'm going to look at, just chill and take Jessie for a walk at some point. But 
I am going to look at some sort of solution and way of making my office look a lot better and just somewhere where I, somewhere where I want to be on a daily basis because at the minute it's like I've got my monitor light which is good and I've got my light in the corner on the desk but I just want to spruce it up a bit I think so I'm going to look at solutions for that DIY solutions, cheap solutions or cheaper solutions shall we say but yeah I think that's my plan for today so and if anything else happens well I'll bring you along for that journey and I've got the dancing mug this morning so let's see if that um, dances away from me no I mean it'll be camera shy again but let's see Oh, come on. Why does it do this? Like, every time I've poured the hot water into that mug, it has shimmered away, danced away twice now. I've put it on camera and it's not done it. Why? Come on. Nobody's going to believe me. Okay, so I know that Newcastle versus Fulham, or Fulham versus Newcastle, should I say, is on later on at 7pm. And if you didn't know, I support Newcastle, so I was looking forward to it. And because it's FA Cup, I thought, oh, it's not going to be on telly. Since I was on ITV4, so I can watch on ITVX. Four, get in, 7pm tonight, we're watching Newcastle versus Fulham. Before then, it is time to put the kettle back on for another cup of tea. We've got the Newcastle United supporting mug. Put the tea bag in. As it is time to put you on the tripod is I am doing some filming over there, as you can see. So, yeah. Just doing some non-vlog videos for the YouTube channel that will go out on, like, not every Sunday, but on a Sunday, uh, when I come up with ideas and stuff that I think are good. So doing the first one now and seeing how that turns out. <laughs> Boom. Absolutely nailed it. So, just filmed the first video, it was okay, I'm just getting back into it, but boom, finished it. It's not that long, but it's only five tips, it's quick and easy. I don't like watching those, you know, 40 minute, 20 minute long wiry videos, that are like five tips, going well in depth about it, straight to the point, fish bash bosh, done. So I've just been told to go to the shop and get stuff for lunch, because we don't have anything in until tomorrow. So, here I am at the shops now. 20 minutes, okay. Well, just got back from the shop. Didn't want to show you inside, it's too busy. So, you know, it is what it is. And in the bag, we have got, we have got wraps. Onion rings. And some whisper bars. You know, when you eat a whisper, you have to whisper into the camera. You have to whisper like this when you eat a whisper. Did you know that? Mm. You've got to whisper when you have a whisper. Ha! But yeah, that's it. That's the lunch. Oh, and we have sausages. We've been in an air fryer, but yeah, that's the lunch. Sausage wraps. Hey, so I've just been editing down the, I was going to say vlog, no video I did this morning. And I've just got the TARDIS to put in, but how good does that colour grading look? But yeah, so this will go out tomorrow, actually, which is Sunday, and go out at 6pm, but it's about five tips when starting vlogging. Just little bits and bobs that I know and have like learned along the way whilst vlogging when starting vlogging so it's just a quick little how long is it seven minute video of just five tips really they're not like you know big genuine tips they're just things that i've learned and things that'll be helpful for people if they're looking at starting vlogging so yeah pretty popular video i've just dropped pumpkin off for babysitting which is babysitting tonight for a, for a couple of hours and it's now quarter to so there's fans down there we go it's now quarter to seven and Newcastle kick off at seven. So I've got to get it on quick, switch on ITV and get the match started. And the verdict says we made it in time. So we got there. Well, I got back. We have about four minutes spare. We're 10 minutes in now. I just thought I'd, you know, watch a bit and then vlog. But yeah, we made it. Up the tunes. Who are the lads? Whenever I do, um, you know, talk about Newcastle, like, up the tunes and all that. I was a little bit jawny, and it's funny, but it's like, up the tune, away the lads. Yeah. It's, it is what it is. Support the tunes. Yeah, we've got to go jawny. Because they're in Newcastle. Well, they're not. They're in Fulham tonight, but, yeah, they are from Newcastle. Because the Newcastle team. Knowledge. 200 IQ, I tell you. But, yeah. 
So I'm going to watch this, have a bit of pizza, and then pick up pumpkin later. So hopefully we win the game. I'm thinking 2-1 to Newcastle. Because Fulham are on a bit of a streak at the minute. So I'm hoping it's 2-1. If we lose, something's got to get done. We've got to buy something in January, surely. Like, we can't be selling our players to buy players but not getting anybody in. Surely. And don't let Miguel Almiron go. Because I love him. Get in! Come on, Longstaff! Come on, oh, screw the bloody VR! Come on. What's happening? Come on. Come on. Please allow it. Come on. Come on, we are gave the goal. Get in, Sean Longstaff. Get in. Well, it's half time and we are 1-0 up. Get in. But it has been a bit end-to-end, -end, so we'll see how the second half goes. But it's in Newcastle's favour. Don't let us down now. Don't cock it up. Let's go the tunes. And first, for, well, first, whatever, for the second half, I'm going to put a kettle on. And of course, the tea is in my Newcastle mug. Well, it's not a Newcastle mug, but it's black and white. So, I call it my Newcastle mug. Of course it's in there. So, let's kick off the second half. Come on, get in, Dan Burn. <laughs> oh, if you don't know, it's now 2-0. Hey, come on, 2-0, full time. Away are the lads, but... Well, away are the lads, not away are the lads. Away are the lads. But, I've got to admit, though... It's good to see us get through because the past couple of competitions, we've something's cocked up or something's messed up or we've, you know, just lost it at the last second and we've made it through. So, let's go. A couple of hours have passed since Newcastle won, and I have been out, picked up pumpkin, and now we're back. Hi. She's back. And what are you making? Tuna, let mayo, lettuce, wrap. Because I am bloody starving. I'll blame you. No. And it's a new day and the same vlog today. And I welcome your faces. Yep. So it's a new day and the same vlog. New day and the same vlog. Yeah. So not long after Punky made her wrap ham lettuce wrap thing. We got pretty tired. Much of it, we stayed up till about quarter past one AM because um, we ended up playing beauty and stuff. But after that we kinda of just fell asleep straight away in bed. So here you are. It's a new day. And I've got the kettle on and I've got no toast. I've got no bread. So, it's Rice Krispies today, or Crispy Rices if you want to call it, from Aldi or Middle. Where's it from? Where's it from? Uh, oh, Aldi! So, uh, yeah, so I got that this morning, and then later on today, about lunchtime, we are going out for lunch at a pub in the town, just on from us, um, to celebrate. Um, pumpkin sister's birthday again. Well, I say again, it's with the full family on pumpkin side, so that should be fun. And before I do any of that, well, after I've had breakfast, before we go out, I've got to try and come up with a thumbnail for today's video that's going out. So I'm thinking of one of me just um, like holding the phone, vlogging, and then getting the camera capturing it, and then seeing what generative AI can do on Photoshop. Or the phone might be good itself, so we'll see. But first, breakfast, get changed, thumbnail, and then get to the pub. As you can see in the background, I've got my camera, and I've just been shooting my YouTube thumbnail for today's video. However, I couldn't show you any of that, purely because I had to use my phone in the photo, and then use the camera for taking the photo, and I've got no other way of filming me doing that. So here's your proof, I have done it. I'll show you the um, process in a second once I get the photo imported into Lightroom so I can edit it. And then we're going to put it into Photoshop and just see if generative AI can, you know, make something good. I was going to say, there's a little sneak peek, but we've already seen this. That's the photo I'm playing with. Uh, let's see what it can do. That might even be like the perfect photo for it, but I'm not sure yet. We'll see. And after a palaver of... <laughs> so, a palaver of just trying to get the thumbnail done, because basically... I have a specific font I want to use, which I like, but it's in Canva, but I can't get it in Photoshop, because it's not in the Adobe font. I could download it for free, but see the with that. 
But um, so what I've done is I've done the photo in the background in Photoshop, done all that, and then import it into Canva, and then put the text in via Canva that way, and then downloaded it. Bit of a palaver, but it works. You can see all this bit here, and the background was Photoshop, and then the font was Canva. But yeah, there you go. That's the thumbnail. That's now uploaded. So the video is 100% complete, 100% 100% scheduled, and ready for 6 p.m. today. So you'll have already seen it if you follow the channel. But I do appreciate it. Go watch it. It's a quick little, you know, five tips uh, when starting vlogging type video. Well, it is that video. It just a quick, I think it's like seven minutes long, seven minute long video just to give you a few tips. So give that a watch. And I think this thumbnail might help it in the algorithm and what have you. I don't understand the algorithm, but I hope it helps. It looks like a good thumbnail and people might click it. So hopefully that works. And now it is time to shut down the PC, get out of the house, get to the pub and celebrate Pumpkin sister's birthday. You're in there now. So, right. Didn't show you any of the pub. And the reason why is super duper busy. And we were just so hungry that we just ate the food. And we left. We left. And now we're at B&M. And we're here to get, hopefully get some frames for the prints I want to do in the, I was say kitchen then, in the bathroom. Uh, yeah, so we're at B&M. And... Let's go get those frames. We'll change the frames, not dancing cactuses. We did get the frames. Hey, we're back with the frames. We got frames. So I was a stupid idiot. And uh, this is a pack of three. But when we saw them originally, I thought it was 4 99 for just one. I thought it was a bit expensive. Actually 4 99 for three. So you know what we did. We got two packs, which is six lots of frames. But um, yeah, we need that anyway, because it's for the bathroom. So we've got one, two, three, four frames, A4 size, I think, hope. Um, we're just going to put up at some point. We should look good. Um, just going to hope that they are A4, because we've kind of just taken a gamble and gone, yeah, we think they're A4. So fingers crossed that they do fit in the frames. But I'm quite pleased with that. Oh, and um, because we're, we can't really drill things in and we don't want to, uh, we've got some command hooks as well. So they were £8, but better safe than sorry, isn't it? A few hours have passed now, and I've just been... Oh, I'm currently on with the process of editing this vlog, so it's ready to go out on Monday, which you'll already see anyway, but Monday at 6pm. And that's pretty much the evening tonight. I'm just going to edit this down, watch a bit of YouTube whilst I'm doing it. I just like to, you know, get in that mindset of editing and just cracking on with it, getting it done. So that's our evening tonight, guys. Um, I'd like to thank you for watching. If you are, well, hope you've enjoyed it. Um, and if you have, like, subscribe, and comment. And this one's for you, John.